Welcome back, friends. So we are here with control once more. Into the breach we go. Trying to smash forward and get that levitate. Because I'm trying to float. Medical way. No thank you. No thank you. I can just sneak around you guys, that'd be great too. Nope, looks like I gotta go through you guys. Fuck it, going through you. Going through you. Not around you. We'll come back to that. Don't be a dick door. Oh, this could be a problem, couldn't it? Nope. No, no, no. We're good. Just gotta blow up the thingamajiggers. hit me. Oh, that thing hit me. Holy fuck balls. He fucked me up. Guess my speed tactics are not working too well. Might have to take a little slower. Or I might just say fuck it and try again. Probably what I'm going to do because... My level of patience right now is, eh, at best. Once more, onto the bridge. Now oh, that we got this going on. That wasn't too bad. Try round two on this some bitch. Can I sneak through here? Damn, that would have been nice. Oh, hi. Didn't expect to- oh shit. I have a trunk, you sons of bitches. And this is how you take care of weird zombie plant men, apparently. You just put a trunk in front of them and say, fuck it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, bullshit. Let me do a wall. Okay, third time's a charm, right? that plant in particular. Yeah, now what? Come to the... Th come to the choke point. Please, no, I would love to discuss the finer points of weed control with all of you assholes. Is this a control point? What is this thingy? P6 is what the Bureau calls Dylan. His cell's been breached. Oh boy. Has the Hiss found him? Are Probably. You him? Can you protect him? Probably not. <laughs> well, we can open this up so we don't have to run all the way back around. That becomes a thing. 
to the motel. Hotel. Holiday Inn. Oh, that was creepy as fuck. I can't help him. I, I would like to try to help him. But I can't help him. Yeah, that's that's blood. Um, hello, do you need help? Even the wall, ceiling, I'm on the fucking ceiling. Okay. That's unique. Not following the puzzle quite yet. I'm sure, we'll get there. It sounds like it did do something. room up is what it did. Anything new in here? Nope. Come back here? You miss some? Okay, no. It's not. I want to know what's in more of these rooms though. Like what these different symbols are for. Like this, these companies do like to play these long games, though, because them talking about. Uh, it's been a long time since Dylan and I knew each other. Yeah, I'll wondered. Get back to that after she's done talking. What kind of man he grow up to be? Were things as hard for him as they were for me? Maybe in here, they were even harder. So I'm wondering what those other doors are for, because apparently control was mentioned in the Alan Wake game way back. This is the next event would take place in Ordinary, where she's from. Is there something I can help you with? I'm Jesse, the new director. I need to get inside. New director. Right. Uh, well, okay. Hello, I'm Frederick Langston, the Panopticon supervisor. It's not the best time for a tour. We have hiss everywhere, numerous cell breaches, and system failures across the board, but... No, I'm not here for a tour. So, here we go. Founded by Zachariah Trench, the Panopticon is our state... Can you help me find him? Faden. Uh, sure. Darling wanted him somewhere secure and isolated away from people. He's in the maximum security cells, upper level. But there's currently a, uh, a pressing matter, ma'am. We've got an object of power loose in there. <laughs> it's wrecking the place. The Benikoff TV, it's, uh, it's a real doozy. Salvador took a team in to handle it, but no one's heard from them for hours. Time to get me a TV. Story 5 OOP we're talking about, and if we don't contain it soon, it will tear the Panopticon apart. And we don't want all those altered items getting loose, ma'am. No, trust me. Dylan's in there. Yeah. Open the door, Langston. I'll handle it. If you say so. Uh, I usually tell first-timers not to touch anything. Here, I'll get the door for you. Thank you. Good work, you guys. Keep them safe. Can we safe. provide any assistance at this time, sir? Only if you can reboot the cell door protocols without manually accessing them. Sir, we are not capable of completing that task. Please assign us a different task. Why are you talking like that? You know what? Never mind. I'll take care of it. They're trolling you. They trolling you. Which is fine, because I'd troll him too. He seems like the type you would, uh... You'd be able to get under... Ooh, big bold print again. But that object of power might wreck this place before I find him. I'm gonna wreck this place before I find me. How about that? I'm gonna need y'all to move, bitches. Get out the way. Oh shit. Oh, I fucked up. I jumped instead of hit control. 
need my slider skills to be on the point, which they were not, admittedly. Mailbox. Something. Bam. Something I didn't see. Something went wrong with the Bureau's plan to make Derek its director. Yeah, he shit the bed. Marshall made it sound like it was all Dylan's fault, but how much of it was what the Bureau did to him? I don't think she's telling me everything. Well, of course she isn't. She seems shady like that. Oh, hi. Did you want an elevator ride? You could have just come in. We could have talked about it. Dick. This way it is. Where I want to be? It does not seem to be where I want to be. I guess I can open that. You'll be fine. I'll be back. Maybe. How you doing? You okay? Weird to see actual friendly bodies fighting. Don't tag me with a rocket, I'll be pissed. No, you don't. That's the object of power. I Come here, TV. Levitation shall be mine. No, it got away. Who saw that coming? All right, time to go for a ride. Yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah, no, we get it. You're a mystical TV. Fuck off. Have my mouse back, though. That'd be nice. Thanks. I'm here for my TV. Ow. He said, no, you're not. I'll just clean the floor. The hell even hit me there. You can have that back, asshole. I could really use some health right about this point. Shut up, Salvador. Yeah, we really gotta take out his shield before we get all into that, I guess.
Ow. Oh, he caught me. Caught me before I could catch him. Although, granted, I don't even think I should be fighting him at the current level of things I have. Considering I have fuck all of anything. Nothing, no mods really, just the base ones. Oh no, I'm all the way back here, fuck this noise, come on. Don't be like that, don't be a dick. Okay, I'm not that far, never mind. Carry on, carry on. Although this run to do this fight, kind of annoying. At least I don't have to watch the TV bit again. I guess I could have also just paused it till I got back to him, right? That would have saved me some time. Well, saved y'all some time. Not me. I'm stuck running either way. So enjoy my suffering. Apparently I gotta wait for him to come down. Yeah, I just do that. Welcome. Anything that cl gets close, we're just gonna Jedi in the face. Oh, oh, can't get me. I'm behind a wall. Nope, no thank you. Well, if I were just chucking objects back and forth at each other, like, no, no real strategy. Just whoever can lob the most telekinetic objects is going to be the winner. And dodge the best, I guess. Which I think will be me. How many, how many guys you got? I'm calling bullshit. I don't have guys. I want guys. Did I take out all your guys? I feel like I took out... Well, I took out most of your guys. Because I'll be honest. God damn, son. I switch this up to the pew pew gun. But when I do get him down to the ground like that. Oh, he's getting aggressive. He's getting aggressive. I don't like it. He's getting aggressive. No, you don't. <laughs> you ain't that hard. Uh, Salvador, the head of security. Yeah, it was. Stand a chance against this. It was, wasn't it? Oh, he disappeared. Yeah, hey, Mr. TV, come here. I need you. I got a puzzle to finish. <laughs> that's that's the entire point of this. Okay, the TV. Another object of power gone. Actually, let's first pick that up. Here we go again. And do some of that. And now we'll grab the TV. <laughs> Use the TV, babysitter. <laughs> Levitate superhero over the obstacles. Alright then. 
We are ready, I guess. I like how it catches you. As long as you hit space before you land. Three dimensional warfare gives me the advantage. Ridiculously so. I guess I should just keep moving on, because they're just going to keep spawning, apparently. And I like the fact it's not tied in with the uh, energy. This is that a broadcast must okay. something. Dealt with the TV. Ooh. Now I can find Dylan. Eh, maybe. May Ooh, major targets. Research division. All right. So I think what we're going to do here is we're going to plop up to here. Kind of hoof it out. Oh, for love of fuck. Yeah, no, now what? Come down here. Come down. I bet you won't. Dicks. Fast travel. Actually. We got levitations. Got C to smash the ground. Ground slam damage. A lot of damage, but... Oh my god, why am I having to hold this? There we go. If I click on it, it goes faster. I don't have the points. I could reset abilities for 30 grand. But I don't know if I'm feeling that. So what we'll do is we'll fast travel to where we're going. We're going to the maintenance sector. We want to go, what, up to here-ish, somewhere? I mean, it really doesn't matter. I don't know how many security levels there are. I'm going to have to figure that out as well. After I get the last one, I might go on just an exploration spree. Alright, so back in the day when I was trying to climb, I went and did here to here to here, obviously. To not there because I can do that now. And I can do that. And then that. And these assholes show up like it's the cool thing to do. But like I said, three dimensional warfare gives me the advantage. Done? You, you done? You done being cute? Hmm. 
So we can't get that eye. Interesting. But we can use this platform here. And voila. How much goddamn easier than uh, whatever the hell I was trying to do. I don't know how I would have done that jump either, to be honest. A lot of shit I don't know how I would have got to, even if I had gone up to that level. Alright, now I gotta go down somewhere to the furnace, right? Where we're headed somewhere. Yep, come with me, TV. We're going for a walk. I think it's this way. Nope, that's the coolant pumps, so it's not that way. Oh no, I gotta let my TV down. Absolutely not. What the hell is this horse shit about? What a dick. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, took my, uh, my I'm taking my TV for a walk. Just needed to put it on the elevator with me, apparently. Where the hell am I going? This doesn't seem right at all now, does it? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Can I have my TV back? Thank you. Fuck. Well, that's not the right way, is it? I guess I did fuck up and go the wrong way. the furnace at? Did I take a left when I should have taken a right? Did I go upside down? What the shit am I doing? I honestly don't remember. Which is just silliness. Okay, well, I'll tell you one way I do remember. Oh, it was on that side. Son of a bitch! Big old furnace chamber right there in front of my face hole. Oh, god damn it. Alright, time to go. Quickly now, quickly, quickly. Made this a longer run than I needed to, didn't I?
made this way longer than I needed to. I am brilliant. I am a Jainus. Alright, so six TV. Let's do it. Eternal Fire Weapon Mod. Let us see what this is about. Exclusive to a grip. Ammo refund chance on hit is a hundred percent. Well, that could very well be interesting. So on hit, we get a hundred percent chance to refund pew pews. But it's only on hit, so it doesn't it doesn't quite matter. Take a grip and plug in what? That, which is an epic mod. Then you go in here and we, uh. Charge all of the three explosive projectiles that can stagger enemies caught in their blasts. Pierce. You can upgrade grip all the way. We got no ability points left. And let's see what we can put on the grip. Besides eternal fire. A lot of these are exclusive ones though. Damaged armor, rate of fire. Rate of fire could be pretty hilarious, to be honest. Let's test it out real quick. Since there are assholes down this way, I do believe. Oh shit, did I? I fell into oblivion. Oh, the major targets, I forgot about them. Wah -wah. Oh, use evade just before fall, or just before landing to prevent fall damage. I did not know that. That is good to know. Not anymore, since I have levitate. As long as I don't jump into any doom pits like I just did, I should be technically fine. as I go about to do the same damn thing that I just did. Hey guys, I came back to play for a little bit. Well, as long as you're hitting... But I think the, uh... I think the Jedi power is still a little bit better. But yeah, it does work. It does work. Anyway, let us go ahead and get into our expositions. Salvador's ID, which is a big one or whatever. Benikoff TV, which we know lets us float. The background of the Benikoff TV, the object was first discovered in a local news story from Kansas. The figure has been seen over buildings. We are dispatch agents to the town who discovered the man named has bound himself to the object. He was detained so he can do it. to the Bureau for study. Anchor supplement. Crew of the White Ocelot first encountered a strange spherical phenomenon while fishing in something. Witnesses described it as a black sphere with a faint light behind it. 
hovered just off the bow of the ship, the crew, by throwing a tin bucket which appeared into the sphere, soon after the vessel lost structural integrity. The ship's metal rusted, fell apart within minutes. As the ship sank, the sphere lowered into the water. A passing fishing vessel called to called the rescued the four survivors. Agents were dispatched to the White Ocelot's last known coordinates and began diving operations on the ocean's floor. Agents found the sphere. The ship was entirely destroyed, except for its anchor. As agents lifted the anchor to the ocean, off the ocean floor, they noticed the sphere behaved in conjunction with the anchor, moving and, moving and stopping as one. Contact with the sphere was avoided, but handling the anchor proved harmless. The item was transported to the FBC... And we will fight it later. Oopsie, I forgot to read the last one. Oh no, whatever will I do? No multimedia, no hotline Miami's. So, I think we're going to call it for now. We're going to play around with some things. But uh, we'll be back to continue in a bit, my friends. Until then, as always, have a good day. Stay safe out there. And hit that subscribe button for me if you would. I would appreciate it.